Hello friends and welcome back to Friday Night Files and another episode of Drug Dealer Simulator. Our Rags to Riches playthrough. We start as a low life drug dealer. Uh, yeah, Friday Night Cartel, yes please. We are level 2. From a low life drug dealer to a effing kingpin. Yeah. It's gonna be the baddest cartel of all time. I'm so looking forward to when we can hire people, you know, to to do the drug dealing for us and all of that stuff. Where are, where are we? Oh yeah, we're in Lanzo's, I think was his name's office. What's our objectives? Find casual clients. Look around the archipelago and locate some casual clients to make additional sales and increase demands. So I think that means that that we had to give them samples. Or something like that. To build a relationship to Lanzo. Meet marks with context available real estate to obtain additional hideouts for your operation. We got stuff to do. <laughs> but also, I don't know how we are getting time yeah, to... Yeah, that place oh? is a mess. Eh? But it's just for the time being. Always up a notch from that filthy bunker though. Anyway... Go out there, earn some money, so you can move to a normal place of your own. Ah, oh yeah. So this is a hideout that we can use. What does this okay, do? now, that's your base of operation. Here, you can check the status of your territories, your wealth, your street cred, and much more useful information. It will come in handy. Okay, I don't know what these icons means. Probably what he said, but... But it doesn't say, what's this one? Is this our regular clients? What is this one? I don't know. But this is one huge map that we have to take over. So we are good on the small island. Who the F are you? I don't know. Let's find out. So now it's time to take over the archipelago. Uh, how do we get to our phone? So we don't have any customers calling us right now. What do we have in our bag? We have no one grams. Uh, you have one, one one gram bag. We need more if we are going to give out samples, right? Because we are not giving samples of two and three grams of wheat. So, uh, should we go to sleep as it is night time? Um, maybe we should use use the night time to uh, to go do all these missions that we have, because there will be no drug dealing, you know, here in, at night time. Get in. Yeah, take advantage of the day to sell drugs. And all other stuff we'll do at night. You ready? Come on, follow me. Lead the way. Okay, let's go then. Where are we going? But this is Billy. <laughs> See how your knees are after all those years. How long has it been, huh? It's been a while. But this was Lance's friend. To my home. Let's go upstairs. What a home. Talk on the balcony. One day we'll get a home like this. In this game, that is. Let's have a meeting. Dude, how good to see you after all these years. How did you end up in my shit? Your shit hole? I have set myself up pretty damn well over here. See them GSM towers? My cell company owns it all. I took East Sombra out of the Bronze Age. So what's your story? Damn, nice. So you control the cons? Nah, man, not exactly. You don't have much control even over the shit you own under a dictatorship. 
still make me rich though. Cool. Maybe we'll get rich together now, huh? So you're here to take a piece of the Central American dream, huh? Damn deal, damn right I am. Set a small drug operation with Marcus and the others. Marcus is here too? Yeah he is, man. Tell that pale motherfucker to come visit sometime. <laughs> what kind of drug? Wheat, amp, the easy stuff. For starters, at least. Damn, we gotta team up then. Yeah, hell I yeah. Storm the island. I know the place, have a few contacts, know a few people. Awesome stuff. You're rich. You want to be part of an illegal operation now? Illegal? Shit, no such thing as legal or illegal here. There's things the government doesn't care about, and there's things they don't like you doing. Local cops might cause you some trouble, but until you cross the militia, we're good. What about them? Um, don't worry. Think about that when you get large enough for them to care. By then, we'll have other words. Okay, cool. Okay, listen. Here's what we'll do. I'll make some phone calls, do some arrangements, and get back to you later. We got a lot of work to do. My employee will get you. Sounds great. See you later. Your, empl your employee will get me home? Eh? New voice message from Marcus. How do we listen to that one? Here maybe. We new record a message. Visit a stationary phone. Okay. Do I have a phone I can use? <laughs> well, I actually mean it. Do you? Uh, okay. Maybe downstairs? Guy don't have a phone? Probably couldn't afford it. <laughs> okay, that's outside. That's outside. Okay, <laughs> maybe this house ain't that big and and as nice as it looks. Because these are the only rooms. Where's your bedroom, dude? Okay, I guess he doesn't have a phone. Let's get into his employee's car. He'll drive us home. You can use land vehicles for quick traveling, blah blah blah. Go to the car to travel back. Already done that. So where are we now? Ah, he drove us. Did he? Now we were down here, right? Check your voicemail. Okay, in here? Do we have a flashlight or something? We do. What the F is this place? And is there a phone in here? Can't be, right? Oh yeah, this was our house, right? Now this Lanzos place. And we had a phone in the back room. It was this one, right? Yep. Uh, play. Yo man, listen up. Could you pick up the boat engine from repairs on your way back from the Twins' crib? Also, Alonzo mentioned a friend of his who has some cheap houses for sale. Maybe it's worth looking into, huh? Out. Out. <laughs> Got the cash to fix the lab. Don't mind if I do. Hold F for options. Uh, okay. Do nothing. <laughs> so now, get a cash to fix the lab. We need fifty thousand. Let's just call them credits or something. Retrieve the repaired motorboat engine. That will cost us thirty thousand. How much money do we even have? 
84, 83. So I do have money for to, to fix the lap. Collect the required amount and give it to Marcus. Okay, alrighty then. Visit the botanist and check on his offer to improve your cannabis production. Let's go ahead then. And do that one. Uh, it says we can mark it if we press F, but... Uh, okay. It is in this direction. <laughs> so dark, I don't see shit, man. On the right way. Yeah, we are. Just straight ahead. Hey, Rob, see that blockade? Rob, uh, it ain't there for the giggles. The locals set these around on roads and on borders of territories. Local bandits pay close attention to who's passing. Sometimes even set out people to stand on the checkpoint. So oh. look out. Before you earn a name in the new area, I'd stick to boats for safety. Transporting valuable or illegal stuff using roads is also okay. Risky, so keep that in mind. Thank you for telling me now. After I passed it, <laughs> you idiot. Could have told me before. Okay, let's not go that down there. it this thing or in this house or I do have a marker right here but under the bridge here maybe no huh? maybe it's only in daytime yeah it sure is marking this house. Right? We also have the icon, it's also this house. But there's no one here. So I guess we can only do that in daytime. So what do we want to do? We could go ahead and fix the lab, I suppose. Gain information on available hideouts. We have to go all the way down here to get to a bus stop, but we don't have a bus stop down here. Damn it. Lanzo Jean Louise. Jean Louise. Uh, let's find the safe way back. <laughs> don't want to jump down there. Now you have to cross that. You know what? Let's go see the botanist. We can find our way up there. Can't jump. White man can't jump. Let's not break our legs down here. Oh, and we broke our leg. So as the botanist, is he asleep? Or can we... Can we come in please? Hey man. Sorry for flashing the lights in your eyes. Do I know you? Marcus sent me. <laughs> You've mistaken me for my brother. He's sitting over there. Got it. <laughs> Goodbye, friend. Oh, those are the Bye twins, yeah? Do I know you? Marcus sent me. Gotcha. You can buy seeds and other goodies from me. You can also talk to my twin brother. He sells lab equipment, you know. So it happens he's standing just over there. Thanks. Oh, hello. Now, what do you need? 
I don't know if we need anything from him right now. Or maybe some seeds. We're not... We're not going to buy this. We can grow our own. So this is a lot of... Equipment. Flower pot. Okay. Some rolling papers. Maybe we can make pre-rolled joints. Let's buy some of these. Five seeds, please. That is one of five, right? Did you buy it? No, that's only one seed. Okay. Let's buy one more. And... Let's do some fertilizers as well. Two of them. There we go. Cost us almost 10,000 credits. Come back when I restock. I'm sure you'll find something for now. Yourself. What do you need? But he sells some different stuff, you know. I don't know if we need any of that well, right now. Pity. Goodbye. Goodbye. We have retrieved the repaired motorboat engine. Let's go ahead and do that. We have to go south and then that way. Uh, how do we get back up there? <laughs> God damn it. There we go. Again, I don't see shit at night. Oh no, we're breaking our legs again. Now we have to be really careful. We don't die. Could we? What happens if we eat some sausage? How do we even eat it? Eat, man. Maybe put in the quick slot. That did help. Awesome. That restored our health. So that's what the food are for. See if we can cross over that bridge down there. This is the right bridge, right? Yeah. Sure is, man. So I guess in this episode there won't be a lot of Dealing drugs. We're just doing the the opening missions here. Get our operation started. Not the small time operation. To go through here. This looks like a dangerous place to be. No, maybe not. Is he in here? Or is he on top of this? Probably, yeah. Oh, these are the roadblocks that we have to look out for. Okay, so he's on top of here. Or that motorboat thingy. Motorboat engine. Let's see if we can find a way up there. Uh, okay. Are we getting stuck? We are. Yay! Damn it! Let's break our legs a little bit. No? Here's a way up. It's a weird place to... I, mean, I don't know if you're going to buy a motorboat or steal it or... I mean the engine. And go up this way. It's 
Is this the guy you need to talk to? Pedro Alvarez. Marcus sent me a thing about real estate. Oh yes, that. I am on vacation, but I have a man. He will show you around. Okay, I thought this was the the motorboat engine. Thanks. Where do I find this fellow? You will find his number on the sales board. Call him if you want him to watch the place. Okay. Got it. Thanks. Alrighty then. We have a new voice message. Probably from... From that guy. Uh... Here they repaired motorboat engine. Well, I did try. I thought it was here, but obtain a new hideout. We're going to do this one because we have to take over the archipelago now, right? So these are all hideouts and the furniture store. Ah, oh, the repaired engine was over here. So straightforward. Alrighty then. Can we even afford it now? I have 73,000 on us. And we need 30, yeah, we can, we can do it. And we just have to sell a shitload of, of dope tomorrow. So we'll take the regular road this way. Not there. <laughs> I don't see the road. Is it this one? No. Down this way, right? That's the wrong way, man. This way, then. <laughs> This was the hideout, yeah? Yeah. Don't need a hideout right here, right now. Or I don't think so. It's about to be daytime. So we should have gone home and prepare, you no, know, wheat to sell. Hey man. 30k for the repair. Do you got it? Yeah. It's heavy. Have anyone to help? Not really. There's a bus stop nearby. I'll fix you a ticket. Thank you. Thanks, dude. I'm selling my own book. If you're interested, it's not going to be here. Also, you should visit my cousin. So I guess we'll use these boats you know, to smuggle and stuff like that. Good to know. Thanks. Thanks again. Pay 30k. Come back. Look, there are a few different means of transport you can use in the game to travel around without walking. Land vehicles, you know, like buses, cars, or motorcycles. All that can be used for quick traveling between spots and areas you unlock. Boats, on the other hand, can be used to travel wherever you like. As long as it's on the water, obviously. Get used to it. You'll use them a lot while expanding. So where's that engine? So we can use quick travel to get back. We need a better boat. Mount the engine on your boat. Do we have the engine on us or? Here it is. So we can mount this, mount it on this boat. I guess no. <laughs> uh, how do I get back up? Not sure. So where's that boat? Ah, here it is. Okay. So I don't know where all these bus stops are. We have one here. But where are all the others? Um, 
Okay, we have to go down here, over here, down there. Across here. So yeah, we have to uh, to see the bus stop in real life here before it before we can see them on map. I think. So where the hell are they? Should have seen some by now. Yeah, I'd say. We don't even have one on our island here. Let's go mount that engine on the boat. See what it does. We can start s smuggling business or something. And I don't think we want to cross over here, right? Because we couldn't swim all the way without drowning. I believe. Maybe. Let's try. Because we won't really die. You know? Okay. <laughs> we drowned. But a good thing, we don't die, we just end up on the shore. Now let's head down to the boat. Can we jump this fence? Nope. Sparp wired. Not the bestest of ideas. Okay, we have to get down there somehow. I guess this is our new boat. Soon mounted with an engine. Install engine. Yeah. And now we can oh, listen, sail around. You move the boat just like you walk around. Sprinting will also speed it up. But first, you need to undock it from the pier to be able to move. You dock it back in place the same way when you reach your destination. You can use awesome. both to travel as well as transport or smuggle items around the island. Oh, yeah. And consider buying a better boat. This one is trash. No shit. <laughs> well, let's leave it. Um, so, you got a boat? Talk to Helen. And we don't have enough cash now. We need 50,000. <coughs> we have 43. So, what we should do. Get back home <coughs> to our safe house and prepare some mar marijuana to sell. But really, where is our safe house? It's right here. This is the safe house, okay. Let's head back home to the safe house. If I can find a way. Here we go. I feel like we should have some incoming messages, yeah? From clients. Maybe it's too early in the morning still. Who smokes weed this early, yeah? It's only 7.30. We 
We are back at our safe house. So that's where we are going to spend our nights on. For now. Doing the... Doing those missions. And... Yeah. That's what we're going to use our nights for, right? That's going to be it. For this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. And comment and subscribe. And hit that notification bell. So you don't miss the next episode. Thank you all for watching. Until next time. Bye bye.